I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Okay. Hey guys, welcome to day seven of Vlogmas. Today we're gonna be doing some Christmas shopping. We're on the hunt for a Christmas tree. They are sold out everywhere. I think that there is, what's that called babe? A national shortage because of COVID and everything like that. So it's really hard to find Christmas trees. I've been looking at my local Walmart and they don't have them in stock. I even asked if I could buy the display Christmas tree and they said, no, you can't until a later date. So if we want it, we'll have to wait closer to Christmas to be able to get it. So today we're gonna be going out of town we're gonna go to Lowe's we're gonna go to the super Walmart out of town I want to go to Bath and Body Works and then we have to go to Kroger because Aaron has to get his COVID booster shot so we have a lot of different errands today I want to look for some Bath and Body Works scents that match a fragrance I just recently got I purchased the Billie Eilish fragrance and I love it so much it's like warm vanilla it's sultry I love it but I don't really have any lotions to go with it I have like fruity lotions so I'm gonna look for some um, good lotions that pair well with that fragrance that are like really warm and this is a perfect time of year to shop for those type of fragrances because I feel like during Christmas time they always have like sugary warm smelling lotion so I got some coupons in the mail and I also have the Bath and Body Works app so I have some coupons and some free items on there so we're gonna get some stuff from there Aaron you're in the background changing <laughs> I'm trying to stay out. Everyone's gonna be like, ooh, who's in the background with their shirt off? My man, that's who. <laughs> and then, of course, Lowe's, we're gonna look at Christmas decorations, Christmas trees, Walmart, we're gonna look at Christmas decorations, Christmas trees, and I'm also going to look for Christmas DVDs. I have a long list of Christmas movies that I want to own. So that way I don't have to like buy them or rent them every year on Christmas. Just, you know, like staple Christmas movies. I have quite a few, but I want some more. I have a list. We're gonna look for some Christmas movies. And Dickie's matching me. Did you wear yours? Oh. You tell me you didn't notice? I didn't even notice. Because you had a coat on. I got us these shirts for Thanksgiving so we can wear them on Thanksgiving. It says no pride in genocide. And even though it's not Thanksgiving, I put mine on today because I haven't worn it yet. And I got us matching shirts. And I put mine on and I thought he noticed and I saw him come out with his shirt on and then he's oh, wearing his like I'm wearing this today. and he didn't even know that I was wearing mine. So we're a couple goals and we're matching, which is so adorable. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and head on the road. The first stop is Aaron's booster vaccine. He already went to the gym and stuff. So that way later we can just relax because I'm sure his arm is going to be sore. We're going to get in the car and head on the road to go to our first destination. And Mimi, of course, wants outside yet again. Okay, Aaron just got his vaccine. How do you feel? Fantastic. We waited an hour. I'm not joking, we waited an hour. <laughs> I was losing my mind. Um, but I did film it for you guys and it's finally done. Thank goodness. We can now move on to the other stores we want to go to. Next stop is Lowe's. Okay, so they don't have a lot here and it's really, really busy. They have no Christmas trees for sale. You can buy the ones on display, but they're really expensive. So yeah. Okay, no Christmas trees at Walmart. They didn't have one Christmas tree in a box at all. They only had display models, which is the same as it is in our town. I did see someone loading up a display in their cart though. So that tells me you're able to buy display trees now. So when we get back to our town, we're gonna check. So the only thing I got was a movie. I got a Christmas story. I also got these two um, center things. You hang these in your trees if it's a fake tree and it makes it smell like a real one. So I got the fragrance fur. And then I also got the fragrance Oh Christmas Tree. So I thought together they would smell really good. I've used those before when I had a Christmas tree and it smells just like a real one. 
So I'm going to use those if I find a Christmas tree. So now we're on our way to Bath and Body Works and we're gonna see what they have. I'm excited because I know I'm gonna find some good stuff there. Okay, we just got out of Bath and Body Works. It was insanely busy, so I couldn't really film in there. There was employees everywhere, and I just didn't want to get kicked out because I wanted some good items. So show them what we got, baby. Oh yeah, we got two bags full of stuff. I'll show you the breakdown of everything we get today when we get home, but I did get some really good items, and I'm very excited. So now we're going to Lowe's, which is the second to last stop. Hopefully they have good Christmas trees. If not, we'll go to the Walmart in our town, but we're gonna go to Lowe's right now. Look at all these Christmas trees, you guys. They have so many real ones and they all look really pretty and they're all different kinds. I've never been here, I don't think, during the winter time. Only $648. We need to go to the cheap section, baby. Look at all this cute stuff. $400, $300, $400, That's the cheapest one I've seen, it's $200. At least they have them though. They actually have trees in stock. This looks so fake and awful. It looks so bad, and how much is this one? $400. Aw, those ones up there are so cute. The Grinch, I love that little bush. Those are cute, look at this. LED motion. And it displays the Grinch logo. <gasps> Whoa, they have cool stuff here. Okay. Yeah. Really? It's cold. No luck in Lowe's, their trees were so expensive. $400. And that was like the average. Like 300, 400 was the average. I am not paying that much for a tree. Like if we were gonna keep it for a long time, I would invest in something like that, but we're moving next year and I didn't want to keep it. The ones at Walmart are less than $100 for good ones. Okay, we're gonna go to Karma now so I can get different jewelry. Karma in the pawn shop. And Aaron wants to go to a pawn shop, so we'll go there too. Okay, they didn't have any longer jewelry for my, uh, what's this called, Medusa? So I guess I'm just gonna wear this one and possibly order one online, I'm not sure. I need to get a longer one because this one digs into the back of my lip pretty bad. But they didn't have a longer one. So we didn't wind up getting anything from there. So now we're gonna head to the pawn shop because Aaron wants to look and see what they have. So let's go. Okay, so we just went in the pawn shop. We didn't get anything except for some DVDs. I actually got quite a few um, DVDs in here. They're only 50 cents a piece. And I like having DVDs on hand in case like the internet's not working and you can't access Netflix or something like that. So I just like having DVDs. So I found some really good movies. So I'll show you all of those when I get home, but it was only $5 and I got a lot of movies. So now we are headed home. Mm -hmm. Now we're headed home and they had a dog in there and she was so cute, her name was Maggie and she was adorable. So yeah, now we're just she gonna head back bull. on the road. A pit bull? Yeah, yeah, I think she was too, some type of pit bull breed. Yeah, she was cute. Okay, we're gonna head home now. We found this tree and it's a display tree so we fucking took that shit. We got the snowman topper. So we finally found a tree, it was only $89 and we're gonna buy flocking online because I really wanted a white tree so we're gonna buy flocking and flock it ourselves and right now it has clear lights on it but i have a whole bunch of multicolor lights at home so we're gonna make more put more lights on it and then i got this because i thought it was really cute 
It's a Santa, it's like four feet tall and it climbs a Christmas tree. It looks like it's stringing lights and it goes up and down, up and down. It's gonna be exciting to open that up and put that on the tree. Okay, so we just got home. I'm gonna give you a little haul of everything that I got today and show you all the fun things I have. All the cats are very interested in what we got going on down here. So we did get a Christmas tree, like I said. It's not um, like fluffed or anything right now, but it has white lights on it. And I will show you the one we got. We just got this seven foot pre-lit Duncan fur, $89. They didn't have any options at our store except for this white one over here on the end. So that's the one we got. Aaron's putting it together right now, but we're not gonna actually put it together and have it up until probably next weekend. But it was already like on the display, so we don't have a box for it or anything like that. So it's pretty easy just to slide the three pieces in together. Oh no, he's about to jump in there. Mimi. <laughs> Listen, you did this when you were a kitten years ago. You're too big now, Bubba. So we did wind up getting a tree. I'll put on screen the tree that we originally wanted. It was a snowman tree. It was all white. And then it had like a snowman topper with snowman hands. We went like last week and asked the outdoor guy if we could just take the one that was on display because we wanted it really bad. And he told us no. So then we went back this week and they were already selling all the display trees and that one was gone most of them were gone and so um i went up to him and asked and i was like are we allowed to get display trees and he was like yeah and i said oh well i was just wondering because i was here a couple weeks ago and asked if i could have a display tree and at the time you guys had told me no i couldn't have it and then he was like oh yeah shortly after you guys were in here uh they changed the policy and let me sell the trees that were on display and i was like great great so we didn't get the tree we wanted but it's okay i got a pretty decent tree this one was only 89 dollars and it has um white lights on it but we have extra colored lights so we're gonna also add colored lights to it and then i got this topper so that way it resembles the original tree we wanted. This was the only topper of the snowman one that was left in the store and it was on a display tree. So I went ahead and took it and purchased this. It was only $12. I thought it was a cute topper. We might flock the tree, we might not. I haven't decided yet. So then I got this Mr. Christmas Santa Claus and it climbs up and down the tree. It looks like he's putting Christmas lights on the tree and then it has LED lights. It plays 15 different Christmas carols and I thought it was really cute. This one is actually pretty expensive, but I feel like it's good. I, I feel like it's a good quality product. It was like $59. We got some tie down stakes because a couple of the outside decorations keep falling over. So we needed some more heavy duty stakes. All of these movies need to be disinfected. Here are the movies I got at the uh, pawn shop. They were 50 cents a piece. I got 13 going on 30. License to wed. How to lose a guy in 10 days. Finding Amanda. P.S. I love you. 27 dresses. Maid of honor. Red. All about Steve. Ocean's 12. And the pursuit of happiness. A lot of those I've already seen, but I just wanted to own them. Hello, Luna. Whoa. Bath and Body Works, baby. Let's go. They were having a sale. Buy three items. Get three for free. So let me show you what I got. Like I said, I wanted something that paired well with Billie Eilish's new perfume. So I found a couple warm toned scents that I think will pair pretty well. I got this Fireside Flurries. It smelled amazing and Aaron also really liked the fragrance. So I got the lotion, the body wash, the body cream, and the body spray. I also got a lotion um, Vanilla Bean Noel. And I also got that in the body cream. And then I got a free item of my choice. So I got warm vanilla sugar. And then they didn't really have any foaming Christmas um, hand soap, which I love Bath and Body Works hand soaps, but I prefer the foaming one. So. This is the only one I could find that was a winter fragrance and it was foaming. And then I don't know if you guys use these, but I love these car fragrances. I love replacing them and I like trying to replace them depending on the season. So I got some warm toned fragrances. I got four Tis the Season and two Sugared Snickerdoodle. So I'll be replacing those in my car. I love having like that nice warm scent in the car and I like it to smell good. And then when I was checking out, she was telling me about this holiday box. Apparently it has a whole bunch of goodies in it and it was only $40 and it was like 130 something dollar value. And I actually use Bath and Body Works a lot. So I was like, okay, I'll try it. So I got this box, it's called Give Love This Christmas. And if I don't wind up liking the items, I can always gift this to my mom. So let's go ahead and open it and see what's inside. Okay, so I just opened the box. Let's see. Oh, these are cute. So these are wishing you a warm holiday lounge socks. And they have a cute little polar bear with a crown. So here's the socks. Cute little polar bear with a crown. This smells good. 
Okay, so we have a little helper here. So in that box was this candle. It's called the Perfect Christmas and it smells really, really good. I will definitely put this on my candle melter. Then we got this Merry Cookie hand sanitizer. It smells really good. We also have a Merry Cookie mini hand cream, shea butter, and I will definitely use these. I love sticking these in my purse or in the car. Then I got this Merry Cookie mini candle and it smells so good. Look how cute they are. Oh, I'm so excited to burn this. And then it came with this trio, body wash, body lotion, and body spray in pure wonderland. And I love the engraving on the packaging. I think it's so pretty and it smells really good too. And then the last item it came with is this hand soap and it's a foaming hand soap. So I actually got two foaming hand soaps instead of just one. The scent is Tis the Season and I love the way this smells. It just smells like Christmas and it's absolutely amazing. So all of this plus the socks for $40. And if you know Bath & Body Works pricing, normally these items are really really expensive and I will definitely use all of these so for me it was definitely a good deal so these are the last items I got now let's go do the Christmas advent calendar countdown I know my hair is crazy it's been a wild day super busy and super crazy I'm very happy to be home okay so day number seven we have a train here so we're gonna put the train up here with all the other ones. That is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out my Instagram. The link to that is in the description down below. I post way more of my everyday life on there. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I love you guys so much and I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye.